Hey everyone, how are you doing? I'm Shannon with Southern Bells Like Big Bows, you, but you probably know that. Listen, I'm getting ready to talk to you all today about, well, first, I'm so glad you're here, but um, I'm going to show you our coral monogram bow. It makes such a great bow, uh, transitional bow for spring to summer. It's super popular right now, and so I wanted to show that to y'all. Um, and then we're going to talk about everything, monogram bows, clips, um, sides that things are worn on, you know, all the questions that y'all have. So, and I'm also going to give y'all a little shop update right now. So let's start with that. Um, so a couple weeks ago, we had our Facebook live sale and a lot of y'all were there and I was so glad y'all were there. I'm a little shiny this morning. <laughs> Can you can somebody do my makeup before I do these? Um, anyways, we had our Facebook live sale and I was so glad that y'all were there. And um, I, I let y'all know that it was going to be the last day that the shop was open. Well, we actually had some delays in our construction and so that is um, it, that has delayed us a little bit, but uh, this week is actually our last week open, which is today. And um, so if you've got any orders that you need to pick up, you want to go ahead and get those right away. Um, and uh, sorry, my our little bell is ringing. <laughs> um, and uh, then next week, we're going to be moving into our new space, but we won't be open right away because we have some things to do. But I'm hoping like by the end of the week, um, beginning of the next week, we'll be open. So just keep posted and I'll let you know about it. So anyways, I just want you all to say hello. If you're here, uh, tell me where you're from, uh, maybe what your plans are this weekend. Just uh just let me know. Of course, my plans this weekend are going to be in our new shop working on that. Hey, just say hello. Make sure to give StreamYard permission so I can see you. Um, I was just giving a shop update. We are getting ready to move over to a new shop. Got some construction to do. So let me know what you're doing this weekend. And uh, I was just telling everybody that I am going to be working on the shop, doing some construction, some hands-on stuff. It's really not that big of a deal. It's just painting and, and probably running a lot of errands for my husband who's forgotten things from um, the hardware store. <laughs> How many of y'all have been stuck in that? Uh, I forgot this. I forgot that. They get to know me really well at the hardware store. Anyways, all right, so we're going to be talking about our monogram bow, which, where did I put that? Okay, here it is. This is, like, the most popular color right now. It's our coral monogram bow. Can you see it? Um, it's really popular for spring and summer. I just realized I didn't play in this, but I'm wearing coral right now. <laughs> but um, it's really popular for uh, spring and summer uh you're seeing it a lot of different places right now. It matches a lot of different outfits and um, it, it, it's a great transition from summer to spring. This is our small bow. It's about three and a half inches wide. Let me see if I can put it next to one of our medium bows. They're pretty close. Um, there's three and a half and five inch wide is our medium. This one's kind of a little more curly than normal, but they're pretty close. Um, so, um, lots of ums this morning, y'all. Sorry. They're pretty close in size, uh, but they, uh, some people like them just a little bit smaller for their little ones. And this one's of course got our vine monogram on it, which is really pretty. It stitches out really well. I really like how vine turns out. I tried to get most people to use it if they like it, that particular font, because it just looks really good. And this one has got an alligator clip with teeth. And um, so briefly, just to let y'all know, to give you an, some information, our alligator clips with teeth, all of our clip options can be kind of confusing to some people. So I just wanted to show you really quickly. I'm also working on a video to, um, to kind of explain it more, but just show you really quickly on the live the difference between the clips. So an alligator clip with teeth you just saw is this one. It's got teeth. And this is a lined alligator clip doesn't have anything on it at all. Um, and so lots of times people get kind of confused on this and they think, well, should I use teeth? I don't want it to hurt my baby's head or my toddler's head. And my suggestion is if you're going to have any kind of hair at all being used, that um, I would definitely do the alligator clip with teeth. It just holds so much better. 
it doesn't come out. The lined one, it just, let me see where I can put it. It holds as well. See, I'm having a hard time tugging on it. Can you see that? But it does slide out. This one, it, it's going to snag some hair, actually. <laughs> if you really, it's really going to, it's going to hold your hair. You can see, it holds it pretty good. Um, so the weight of the bow combined with your hair, you really want an alligator clip with teeth for your, for, for it. Uh, it's just going to hold the bow a lot better. Um, a lot of people use these when they're going to do like a side swoop or something like that um, on their little girl. Um, it works really well. Um, a lot of people like to use these if they are concerned about how it's going to look or if they've already got a headband that has a little loop that they want to put it through. These work really good with that. So probably for a newborn baby or a young baby um, or really teeny, teeny, tiny bit of hair, you could use these. But once they get toddler age, once they've got any kind of hair at all, um, I would definitely suggest the teeth. Okay. And then we've got the French barrette. And we use premium French barrettes, like y'all know. That's, they've got this reinforced metal on the inside. It's a really super strong clip. You don't have to worry about it falling apart. Um, that's why we use them. We, because uh, I know a lot of people will shy away from French barrettes because they they break, they've broken a lot. But we we really get good clips that that doesn't happen. And we've actually got a guarantee for life. So if you ever have a problem with a clip like this, you can just bring it in or send it in, and we'll put you a new clip on and fix it. Because we really stand behind the quality of our products. So <clears throat> that's our French barrette. These I really suggest if you pull your daughter's hair or your 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 little girl's hair up in like a ponytail or elastic or something like that. Um, and you don't want it. If she's really bouncy. Like my daughter, <laughs> she does a lot of bouncing and you don't want it to slide out. And you want it to stay put. <clears throat> Use these in combination. They work really well together. Um, so do the elastic, do the, the French barrette, and then it's going to stay. It's not going to go anywhere. She's not going to be able to pull it out. She can bounce everywhere. It's also really good for sports. Uh, as long as they don't have a policy for no metal. And then if they do say no pedal, no metal, because sometimes that can be a safety hazard, especially as they get older. We also have, which I don't have one of them right now, but we have the option for the no metal ponyo. Okay, so I think that was it. Oh, the one other thing I was going to talk about with y'all is the worn right and the worn left. And I, a lot of people get that confused and it will hang them up when we're talking about monogram bows. But it's only important with a monogram bow. It doesn't really matter with a print because you can wear it on either side and it's going to look fine. But with a monogram bow, you don't want it to be upside down. This monogram right here, you want to be able to read it. So this one is worn right. So it's worn on her right. So don't overthink it. Just what's her right. She's wearing it on her right. Then it's right. If you were to do it left with the alligator clip, see her monogram is upside down. So when you tell us worn left, we automatically know which way to put the alligator clip on so that it will show right. Show correctly. Let's not confuse it with right. It will show correctly for you. Hey, just give me a hello. Tell me. Give StreamYard permission so I can see your name and tell me uh, where you're from. Uh, I'm glad you're here this morning. Okay. So that's worn right and worn left. Like I said, don't overthink it. Which side, her right or her left, does she wear it on? And we'll automatically put the clip on the right side. It only matters with monogram bows. So it's not that big of a deal. Okay, I just wanted to uh, let you know that these bows that we talked about last week, the watermelon bows, we've only got two left in the large size. This is our medium. Um, I actually don't even have a large here to show you. Uh, this is the medium. It's about five inches wide. We have two left in our large size. So if you want to get those, you need to go ahead and go on and order them now because we've only got two of those left. And I think we've got uh, 10 of these left. I don't, I don't know. I have to check my numbers on that. Okay. And I'm also going to give you a sneak peek of what's coming up in the future weeks, which is our glitter bows.
That's all I'm going to show you for now. You got them a little bit last week, and we got some really cute stuff coming up with that. But I think I've hand talked about everything today. I'm so glad y'all are here. If you come on after the live and you have a question, just put it in the comment, and I'll, I'll definitely I'll be looking at them, and I'll be glad to to answer them. To, um, so. That is everything. Remember, if you want to get one of those large watermelon bows, there's only two left. Go ahead and place an order. If you want to get some coral bows, uh, we are going to be moving next week. So I would go ahead and get your order in soon before we're in our transitional stage because uh, it might take a little bit longer than normal to get our orders out. But uh, that's everything for now. Uh, it was great talking to y'all. Bye.